Hello nerds, welcome to Ahmed Coaching and I am your teacher Dr. Anam. Today we will study about what is test cross. Now, what is test cross? The test cross is used to find out homozygous or heterozygous nature of a genotype for a dominant trait. For example, you have two plants. I have round shape plant here and the other plant is also round shape. Phenotypically, they both are round shape, but I wanted to find out whether they are homozygous or they are heterozygous. So, to find out their genotype, I will perform a test cross. Okay, so always remember that test cross is used to find out homozygous or heterozygous nature of a trait. Here we have a round shape. Like I said that we have this capital R, capital R which is a dominant one and capital R, small r. Although the capital R is a dominant one but small r is also present. So how can we find out whether this is a homozygous or a heterozygous. So to find out in a trust cross what we do we cross our plant with a recessive trait plant. For example, we know that wrinkled seeds, they always express when they have the homozygous combination. And we also know that wrinkle trait is actually a recessive trait. So what I will do that I will cross my these two plants individually with the wrinkle seeds. For example, this round shape here we have and I'm going to cross it with a wrinkle shape seed which has small r, small r. And this one I'm going to cross it with also the wrinkle seed. So what will happen? During the meiosis, the alleles they will separate from each other. In this case, we have this small r and the round shape we have only r. But in case of heterozygous, we will have two types of gametes, capital R and small r. And for the wrinkle one, we will have only the small r. In the random fertilization, this small r will cross with the capital R and we will have capital R and small r. So all the seeds, they will be round shape but in this case this capital r it can fuse with the small r to form a heterozygote and this small r it can also fuse with this small r to form the homozygous so we will have 50 percent round seeds and 50 percent wrinkle seeds recessive trait can only express when both the alleles they are homozygous so when we are having a recessive trait it means that originally this plant was heterozygote so this is how we can find out whether a plant is heterozygote or a homozygote by the help of test cross so this is what is test cross i hope this lesson is clear to you if you still have any question you can ask me in the comment section i will see you in the next video